Hey, what is going on everyone? Welcome back to another video. My name is Simplaz and I've just moved into my new house so I will be uploading voice videos again. So today it's going to be how to fix lag on Fortnite, how to fix lag on Windows 10, whatever, Windows 8 or something. Uh, any Windows, any game, so this will work on literally any game. So make sure you hit a like down below. Let's get like 100 likes and I will make a uh, dedicated about an hour video on like PC performance and all that stuff. Actually, 125 likes. So the first thing you want to do is go to Razer Cortex. I'll link it down below. It's Razer uh, dot com uh, slash Cortex. All right, I'll link that down below. You want to click Download now. As you can see, it Windows 10, Windows 8, Windows 7. Download now. As you can see, it's downloading down here. And once it has finished, click on it. Click Yes. As you can see, it will be loading up. So now we do not need uh, Chrome open. We can close that. Uh, Razer Cortex and then click install. Oh, this one goes really fast. It's went up like 40%. As you can see, it's loading up. Uh, so you're going to have to make an email and password. Pretty sure I have one. Um, but if not, just click create account. So I'm going to click create an account just for your sake, as this is a tutorial. All right, so put your email here, make a password and repeat the password and click next. That's all. So, um, after it says, like after you sign in, it will say contact permission. But um, no, I do not want to receive stuff in my email. So here you go. Congratulations, you are now using Razer Cortex 9. So click X. So as you can see up here, it has boost FPS. So we're going to click on boost. I'm going to show you like all the stuff. After downloading this, like your performance will be improved a little bit. But like you have to edit some stuff. So you're going to go to services. Let's see some stuff here. So if you check mark something, I believe that it like closes it down. When you're playing the game. Alright, so um click off of that and go on system booster, it's up here. And then you wanna click scan and it will uh keep your PC clean and fast and optimize your uh PC and it will improve game performance as you can see here. So you wanna click scan, you can see mine's scanning. So as you can see, um my uh six point six gigabytes can be cleared up. But yeah, uh, after that you wanna click on the game booster, you wanna go on Fortnite view dashboard and once you start the game it will start doing its thing like it will close all the apps so like it will uh, click on this and you're gonna check let's say this um, let's say you wanna check um, don't do anything important so like if if I was recording I wouldn't check OBS would I and just like do stuff that you're not using so if you use Photoshop uh, uncheck uh, check this sorry so when a game comes, uh, your, because uh, Adobe runs in the background, so just check that. Once you play a game, it will close, and once you get out of the game, it will come back, if that makes sense. Same for services, this is all the stuff that was closing, and the stuff that's unchecked uh, is just stuff that you need to run your game. So as I am editing this video, I forgot to say, uh, make sure you click the boost now, and then you want to click recommended settings if you don't know what you're doing. Um, just for the sake of, you know, uh, let, let Razer do their thing. Just click recommend settings and you won't have to do anything. So yeah, that's what I wanted to say. Make sure you subscribe. But yeah, after that is done, click play and see your FPS boost up. And if this is like, only does like 5 FPS, you can always click Windows key. So Windows key, which makes you do that. And then you want to hold that whilst clicking R. So it does this. So what you want to type in is temp then click continue now click control a or you can drag like that so click control a or command a uh, if you're on mac i don't think you can do this on mac but um click delete do this with all current items skip these are the items that you're using you're gonna x out go to a recycle bin empty yes do the same thing again this time you're going to type in percent temp percent and this will come up, same thing again, delete, skip again, recycle bin, empty, 50 items. 
Uh, most people have thousands, literally, if you haven't done this before, thousands of items, just delete all that. Um, I had most people in my comments last time saying they had like 8,000, 14,000. Uh, my video of 160k views, you can check the comments if you think I'm lying. So now you want to type in, this is a bit of a weird word, prefetch. So it's like, uh, you can see how it's, it's spelled here. Click OK. Click Continue. I haven't done this in quite a while, as you can see. Delete 211 items, deleted the cycle bin, empty, yep, and boom, refresh, um, restart computer if need be, and yeah, that's about it. Uh, if you did enjoy this tutorial, make sure to hit a like down below. Um, if you want me to upload more videos, hit a like. Make sure you subscribe, everyone that unsubbed, or you might have been unsubbed by YouTube, just hit that subscribe button, and... Yeah, guys, I'll see you next video. Comment be uh, below some suggestions for other people. And yeah, peace out. If you are watching this far, comment um, hashtag uh, 15 and I will know and I will like your comment. Peace out.